Hello everybody, Jacob Sapashnik here, immigration attorney based in San Diego, California. Today I want to talk to you about four visa options for entrepreneurs to be able to come and move to the United States. The four main options today that you can use to be able to move your company, move yourself and your family to the United States. Option number one is the L1 visa. L1 visa allows you to move yourself if you have already an existing company in your home country and you open a branch or an affiliate in the United States. <clears throat> the L1 has been very popular in recent years, allowing entrepreneurs, startups, and existing businesses to relocate and move their companies to the United States. The beautiful thing about the L1 visa is that you can either move yourself as an executive or manager or as an essential employee. And the most important thing is that L1 visas lead you to a green card at the end of the day. Number two, E2 visa. You can come to the United States as a mini investor. With a small amount of money, as $100,000, you can start a company, you can expand an existing business overseas, and you can do, the, do so just with that investment. As long as your investment is at risk and from a reliable source, you can start a company in the United States and as an entrepreneur. Option number three is O-1 visa. If you're an exceptional entrepreneur from your home country, you've done some amazing things, something was written about you, you've achieved something that you can document, you can come to the United States and get an O-1 visa as an, ex as an exceptional entrepreneur and a business owner. The O-1 visa allows you to launch your company here, work for somebody else using your talents and skills from previously achieved accomplishments in business and entrepreneurship. And final option is the H-1B visa as a self-employed entrepreneur. H-1B visa is limited to once a year filing in April, but if you're qualified because you have an education and an idea for a startup or a business idea or a business, you can do so once a year. So here are the four options. L visa, E-2 visa as an investor, O-1 visa as an exceptional entrepreneur, and finally, the H-1B visa as a self-employed business owner. So there you have it. Click the link below to learn more. And if you have any more questions, email us. Thanks for watching.